Did you miss me? I know you did. I've finally risen from the grave. Been out for almost a month. But I'm back and ready for some non-stop action. Get some booze, buckle up, and keep your eyes on the monitor. Okay, my friend. It feels good coming back from a long vacation, and it kinda got rid of my burnout feeling from playing the game. I wanna thank all that have waited, and I hope that you guys are still interested in my content, and I hope that you never stop watching my videos. Now I know that there's nothing new added to the game, so we'll just keep going for some action adventure type of videos. Today is airdrop day. The admin dropped 50 supply drops on a single sector, and some of them contains TNT and some other explosives. These are considered gold in this game. And of course, it's not just my team that's interested in it, but also the other teams. Our goal, kill everyone, get as much explosives as we can, and go home with the loot. Now while I was lock picking our first airdrop, there were already gunshots outside. I think everyone in the server is in the same area. It's gonna be a party. We also noticed that some of the airdrops were already looted, only means we are following someone's footsteps. We tried looking for this team that's ahead of us, and maybe try and ambush them, and take what they looted from the airdrops. After a few meters away, we heard gunshots. We want to take this opportunity and take them from the behind. From the behind? Hilarious. It was obvious that this team that we're following are already fighting with someone else. This is a great advantage for us. We can be the third party. Third party? Mistress? LOL. Okay, I gotta stop making corny jokes and keep my head in the game. Let's blow some heads. Blow some heads? Okay, I'm done. There were a lot of fresh spawns coming back. Looks like some of them didn't make a bed close by. We gotta take out the snipers first before we go charging in. I just love the foliage in this area. If you are on epic settings, it's gonna be hard to spot people. Go low settings man. Take it from me. We saw a vehicle across the field, but we can't just run to it and lock pick it. There were still a lot of people fighting. We need to clear the area first. People were coming from all over the place, so the vehicle that we saw would be the last thing we should go for. We have zero knowledge of everyone's whereabouts. 
Kung doon talaga sila, may dead body doon Ay! Harap to! Harap to! Gagi! Tanong siya pa sa asin! Ugat ako dyan ah! Pabalik ako agad I don't know how we missed this guy man Oh may PT ako! People are crawling everywhere I love it! Good thing we brought some PTs for this event Hindi natatapos reload ni Kenzoy Bug yan sa M1 It didn't take long until the enemies noticed us and started targeting our location. Now the real fight has started. The vehicle that we were targeting was already on the move. I guess we can ignore it for now and kill this random guy in front of me. Wait, 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 wait. <laughs> Golden please added. These guys left their enemies and focused on us instead. I'm not even mad. My potatoing was hilarious. My teammates were able to hold our position, and I was able to get back and help them. I eventually died. And while I was parachuting down, I can't help but laugh, telling myself that I was talking about someone not making a bed, and I forgot to make mine too. Crazy. I guess the admin is not done having fun yet. Look at all those airdrops. There were only two of us left in the area, and I figured that I should pick up all the guns on the ground and place them somewhere. So when my teammates get back, they have something to shoot with. But our enemies have not given up yet. There were no more airdrops close by anymore. I guess they just want to PvP with us. I mean, I'm okay with that. As long as they can keep up. Bad luck, brother. I'm not so friendly today. After clearing the area, I took some of the guns, enough for the entire team to keep the fight going, and dropped them on a random bush. When my teammates arrive, they all picked up a gun, and the non-stop action continues. I gotta say, the enemy team really wants a piece of us. They're still coming back. It's time to show them the LBTD strat. Or what I call, the legendary bush technique of death. I can see you, but you can't see me. I don't care if you hate me, but I'm gonna stay in this bush forever. Let's see how many people we can kill with the legendary bush technique of death. Can you see that guy right there? Well, not anymore. At this point, we're no longer interested with the airdrops. We're hunting ducks now. Funny. Disarm ko, disarm ko, takbo ko dyan, pamotor dyan, lumahan sa akin Oo, yun yan Patakti ka lang ito Patay ako Yung nakabag yun dyan, nakabag, hindi Yung bago yung pumatay sa akin Patay na yun ang abag, patay na Patanggo ako So far, we got three little ducklings from that hunt Let's see what this guy has Hindi kaya i-AKS yun yung taxical test Putang yun na Will you look at that? Free TNTs Not bad Wait, is this mine from before? I don't know, finders keepers Puta ako sa akin oh
These guys never give up. How many times do I have to take them down? Well, it's free guns for us. Why not? Right? I wonder what their meeting is all about. But it's now adjourned. We were able to collect a lot of guns, but not a whole lot of ammo. So we decided to get more kills while moving to a different spot for better view. Remember, never stay in a spot for too long, otherwise, you'll get flanked. Please stop pretending to be a root of a tree. Okay. So we moved to a high ground to get a better view of the place, and boy was it satisfying. You can see the enemies running in the open area. It's like having a target practice. While I was sorting some guns, something funny happened. A teammate got chopped to death. Hilarious. After two hours of non-stop gunfight, there were no enemies on sight anymore. I guess they finally quit. The only problem that we have right now is we lack the ammo to fight another team. There were still airdrops, and we wanted to check if we can still get some explosives. So I suggested that we go to a nearby abandoned bunker and get some ammo from Mr. Brenner's happy house. After doing a quick abandoned bunker run, we were able to get a lot of ammo for our guns and it acted like a morale booster for the entire team. We can still fight, we can still do this for the next 24 hours. Wanna bet? Then keep watching. I know I've been away for almost a month, so I will make sure to feed you with non-stop action. After getting to the drop location, some of them were still locked. But we still need to be careful. We want to get at least a couple more TNTs before going home. Mm. More TNTs. All the airdrops are gone. Glad we were able to get at least some TNTs. We can finally go home now. But a teammate remembered that he picked up a blue card from the enemy, so we had to check it out. This guy might have a million on his account. So we went to C2 Trader. C2 Trader is a PvP trader, so we had to be careful. We followed the vehicle on foot, so in case there's an enemy, we can retaliate. But the vehicle got blown up right next to the trader walls. There were enemies camping the trader. Looks like it's another PvP action. Still wanna bet? Let's get this over with. New goal. Retrieve the car, along with the explosives. We didn't waste time, so we rushed to the trader like we got nothing to lose. Not sure if these are the same guys we fought earlier or not, but who cares? Let's pulverize them. Look closely at my zeroing. It's set to 800 meters. What an idiot! LOL. 
Hindi, hindi. Nasa ka na. Limping, limping. Ngayon doon mo pa, si Jai. Ako, ako, ako. Jai, limping ka tabi mo. I advise that we make a bed before pushing in. This way, we don't have to parachute from place to place. Our vehicle is right next to us. We can get guns there if we want. We just need to wipe these guys and we can secure this traitor. I went inside and checked every corner of the place, making sure no enemies were hiding. I made a mistake and overpeaked, and it got me killed. But like I said, we made a bid for us to get back easily. Pero ba tao sa loob? Sa iba? Lumangoy, lumangoy. Kailangan ng isang pang tao sa gate. Wala, hindi namatay. Asan yan? Tatlo, tatlo main gate, tatlo main gate, tatlo. As you can see, these were the same guys that we were fighting with earlier. You think we can win this fight again? Let's see. May ito pa, sa medic area. Isa si pag manggagaling ka sa labas, may wala akong AK. Distract ko siya dyan, distract ko siya para titira siya sa akin. Southwest ako, Zai. So, Southwest ka? Get this! Ayan ako sa akin. That's why I call an easy wipe. But the last guy, well, he might have just got caught in the crossfire. Sorry, random guy. So, our vehicle got damaged pretty bad that we had to buy a new one. We were able to transfer all the guns and explosives to the new car. And the enemies, well, not even a shadow came back. I hope they learned their lesson this time. I guess we're still the champions of this event. Last team standing. Go to sleep. We are the Apex Predator. Too arrogant. Just a character. Don't take it personal. Time to go home. But before we do, let's do a quick goal recap. For our first goal. Kill everyone. Check. Get explosives. Check. Take home loot. Also check. And for the second goal. We were not able to retrieve the car, but we were able to take the explosives back home with us. Winners. Yeah, we are winners. I hope you like this video. I made it longer to make up for the past weeks that I've been gone. Share it to your friends, man. Share me to everyone. Like I keep saying, thank you for the support. And I hope that I can stream soon. Shout out to all my friends and to everyone that I've played with. See you soon, guys. Keep dominating. Peace.